Hello, my dear students. In my last class, I taught you about the use of quadratic formula while solving quadratic equations. The formula was like this x equal to minus b plus minus root over b square minus 4ac by 2a. Now, today's class is in continuation of my last class. This under, uh, under the square root that portion b square minus 4ac plays a very important role. This portion b square minus 4ac is called discriminant. We write it as d, the capital letter d means discriminant, discriminant. This is why important b square minus 4ac. With the help of this discriminant, we can tell about the nature of the roots without solving the quadratic equation. Nature of the roots means while we find b square minus 4ac and if we get as d positive, that means this strictly greater than 0, say 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, like that, strictly greater than 0, then we can tell about the roots as then the roots are real and unequal. Number two, if d equal to zero, that means this portion, the value of this b square minus 4 is equal to zero, then we can say that then the roots are real and equal. And thirdly, if d is negative, less than 0, then we do not get any real roots, then the roots are unreal or we can say imaginary, imaginary. So this portion is not needed, only we have to check whether d is positive or d is equal to 0. So without solving a quadratic equation, with the help of this discriminant, we can tell the nature of the roots as how it is real or unequal, real and unequal, or real or equal. For example, uh, question number one say the equation is 4x square minus 8x plus 3 equal to 0. So we have to tell about the nature of the roots. Mm. We'll find the discriminant d b square minus 4ac as I have taught you in my last class to identify the values of ABC by comparing with the quadratic formula, standard form. That is uh, B equal to here minus 8 square minus 4 into 4 into 3. So 64 it is 48. If we subtract 14 minus 8, 6, 1, 16, which is positive. So we can say the roots are, the roots are, according to this number one, roots are real and unequal. Unequal. Number two, for example, suppose it is 4x square minus 4x plus 1 equal to 0. In this case, Again, we'll find discriminant d square minus 4 ac. Here, the value of b is minus 4 square, 4 into 4 into 1 is 16. Again, 16 equal to 0. So in this case, d equal to 0. 